Let's play Redactyl number 608 on Tuesday, December 5th. Uh, difficulty level seems to be medium. Nine letter word is the five of a six. Is that who has? I would suggest we're talking about a person. Maybe the six is. But is the something of a person is the title maybe the title of a person who has um taken something I'm thinking of somebody's taken holy orders or the name or the word six originally something to a thirteen five but has Oh, has uh, altered or something to something as those in 11, something and something. So yeah, I think this may be tricky if it's just a general term for a certain kind of person. Oops. Um, R63 in 511 of Six threes nine. Huh. There are eight and nine ten. But five seven five and something on this point, maybe. Uh, maybe there are disagreements or something on this point. Hmm. And had something something in. It has no something etymology. The word six comes via something seven from the four, four of five from the root word of Latin or Greek, I suppose meaning six or six as in something the seven is something is often is most often used with five nine in this case something maybe Something, yeah, there's a lot about the etymology. Yeah, I'm afraid it's going to be a very basic word, and uh, those can often be the, the hardest. Since the five six from the something by about some year the word was something to something um is this from a poem or eight whenever i something something i something um till by about something five and six of five. Hmm. Okay, five are five of a something. Is this a chapter of the Bible or? The something word for six, the German word, but is not used in this sense. Ooh, that's interesting. Seven, and then there's no space before we get the five in italics. Now that just might be a typo or a, an error when the text is taken into the game from Wikipedia. The 
six, about a two dash four dash three four six. As described by the, is that the book or the poet? The two, four, three. No, not getting it. It's funny to see these um, equals symbols. I think it's still referring to language. We haven't suddenly become a mathematical article. The six four. There are something possibilities as to which something of something is something. Which something the following. I think this is three apostrophe two all one word like if you're. So if you're a something, you're something to have something, because that's what you can do. And if you're a something, then you're expected to have 4, 3. Let's see if that's expected. No, but let's see. You you're uh, maybe supposed yeah you're supposed to have because that's what something do i'm investing a lot of words in this section i'm really hoping it's going to help me but i think yeah, if I don't get the 3, 4 and the 4, 3, because that's what, is it something men? Aha! It's being something among old men? No. That's what blank men do. Is it bad men? No. And if you're a three, well, I suppose woman, then you're supposed to have something because that's what women do. Let's put in man as well. Uh, because that's what, is it our? No. That's what. And so five, six, like seven for four, nine is four. As being as something as common, no, as well, we do have common among ten, five. Very curious. Being as something among three men. Um, you're supposed to have four, three. It does seem to be a lot about, I suppose, societal expectations. Let's go back up to the top and see if anything... Oh, look at this. Uh, oh, okay, that's the old language, okay. Ah, something woman. Interesting. Ah, yes. The word something something to something something 
women, but has something to something a something of. Hmm. So, uh, well, let me look at title. I thought might be. No, we do have title. From something the six of seven are title. Four three is common among something with the most common being sixty nine. There is a common belief that something women, oh, are born without a, oh, born with, that something women are born without a five. <laughs> but four five has been done on this by a, It is something that six, three women are born with a five. But something, something during something, a woman's right to be, no, a woman's something to be something very very curious and what is that hyphenated born born something born without a is it that most women some women yeah some women are born without a born without a what but some I suppose research or some It is uh, not part supposed are born that nearly all or almost all are born with a five. I suppose it's some organ or um, spleen. <laughs> What what could women be supposed to have been? But three, eleven, four that will something during does it fall off? <laughs> um yeah, I feel like we're getting into maybe some medieval misbeliefs. Um, is the blank of a, you know, a female? No. Who, who has never? Ooh, who has never? Is the um, it's not the title who is never something in six eleven thirteen women, I suppose, describe now to something thirteen women, but has. As those, as something in 
as often. Yeah. Wow, this one is uh, one of the most intriguing ones we've had, I think, for a while. Four dash six women, maybe, can be something. Men can be seven and nine nine into both. No, into uh, such into can be something called no. The six five six something something as as something something woman. Seven five four can be used. Eight is the four eight um, feminine. Just one feminine. Feminine six nine. Ooh, how about feminine beauty? No feminine. I don't know. I mean, beauty products have existed around the time of around the need or oh, how about around the myth four myths uh, but nine six is a myth who the something myth who I I think there is a feminist book. Um, no, maybe I'm mixing up. Wasn't there something, the beauty myth or the... Uh, by one of the Naomi's... Um, the something myth. And something a woman's between her well, I'm going to be a little crude and say between her legs, and that's exactly what it was. Um, and that seven nine has something a woman's blank between her legs. The four of seven, something to have never something. Oh, is it maybe the virgin myth? Ah, but we do have um, abusing a virgin as a four. Um, is this old religion's um, sacrifice or something? You're using a virgin as a blank due to her seven six. Um, oh, 38 virgins. Ah, the word, the name, the term, who has never, oh, in sexual intercourse. Ah, who has never, well, wouldn't it just be virgin? What other um, term are we looking for here? Um, is the uh, state, maybe, of a uh, person? 
who has never uh, participated who has never what's that verb um, applies I think no um, the term version something 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 but has something a blank um oh so maybe it's just virginities and i was trying to think i was thinking of virginhood but virginity there we go oh my goodness it took me a long time to lose that or i mean find that um all right, there have been 184 games played. The median is 45. I was a little bit behind that with 53. Yeah, not that many people got it within five today. It's actually quite um, spread out, so to speak. There we go. How engaged, of course, was the verb. Uh, blah, blah, encompass a range of definitions. Um, etymology from the old French, okay, from Latin. Um, Latin word. Oh, wow, okay, Middle English. Yeah, I would not have got any of those words. Um, German was one of the languages. Culture, the concept, definitions, etc. Yeah, so these um, sort of everyday words can be the most difficult, so that could have uh, taken a lot longer. Anyway, I hope you're able to solve it as easily. Thanks as always for watching, and have a great day.